Ahead at six, tornado touchdown, stunning images after a scary night of storms. We heard all the trees cracking and everything, and we had just made it down in the nick of time. But today, neighbors helping neighbors, the amazing effort to clean up. Right now at six, from the air and on the ground, an up close look at the destruction from an EF3 tornado that ripped through the western suburbs. We have crews covering all of it. This was once someone's kitchen. Now it is lying in ruins. Tonight we're in hard hit Woodridge, where we're hearing incredible stories of survival as people just begin to pick up the pieces. So many people had their lives changed in just a matter of minutes. But complete strangers are now coming to the rescue tonight. The news at six starts now. Good evening, I'm Allison Rosati. And I'm Rob Stafford. Tonight, surveying the storm damage. It's been less than 24 hours since a tornado tore through the western suburbs. Drone video of the aftermath shows how powerful these storms were. Hundreds of homes are damaged, but tonight we're hearing stories of survival and stories of hope. The EF3 tornado first touched down in Naperville just after 11, then moved quickly through Woodridge and Darien. We have team coverage tonight on all of this. Let's begin begin with Chris Coffey, who is live tonight in hard hit Naperville. Chris. Allison, tonight residents in Naperville are picking up the pieces, and I wanted to show you something that's really remarkable. If you can look, look right back there, there's several dozen people standing in an area that used to be a swimming pool and another backyard. They are there removing debris from a nearby house. But with 130 homes damaged across the area, the mayor says it will be a test. Home after home damaged by the tornado in Naperville, including one totally destroyed and 19 uninhabitable. You could hear just all of this stuff and everything else just coming at my house. 